Hi guys, it's Sydney. Welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if you are new. Today's video is going to be all about jeans. So if you're anything like me, you hate trying on jeans, you go into the store, they're so loose or they're so tight or you just can't get them on all together, which happens to me all the time. Um, so I thought that it'd be helpful for me to share with you guys some of my favorite denim brands and favorite denim styles that I've come across over the last few years that are super flattering on my body type. And a lot of you guys have said that we have similar body types, so I hope that this video can give you guys some inspiration if you're in the market to get some new denim. But before we get into today's video, make sure that you subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. I want to thank you all so much for a thousand subscribers. It means so much to me and I was so excited and it just means the world to have all of your guys' support. So thank you so much for that and let's go ahead and get right into the video. All right, so the first pair of denim I have to share with you guys is from a classic brand. It is from Levi's. So I tend to stay away from Levi's just because a lot of their jeans are composed of 100% cotton and 100% cotton normally just doesn't work for me. I, you know, put them on and they just stop mid-thigh and they won't go any higher than that. But these ones are actually composed of 2% elastane and then 98% cotton. And these are the Levi wedgie straight jeans. And I got these in a size 29 actually, but I am a true size 28 but um i wouldn't say that levi's runs small but i for some reason when i tried these on the 29 just felt better on me so that's the size that i decided to go with um and they are a light wash denim which i love so much and they have fray detail at the bottom so i love fray detail or like a raw hem at the bottom but what i will say is when you wash them they tend to get a little bit frizzy and kind of crazy looking so what i would recommend with raw hen with raw hen denim is that you put a seam at the bottom or you can just wash them and hang dry them so you don't have to worry about the bottoms getting crazy but these ones have a but a button thigh detail which i love it's just like adds to the vintage style and makes them look amazing but one thing that i would say with these denim is that they do have a 26 inch inseam which i'm five six five seven and they look kind of short on me so I don't necessarily love the length of these but I do love the fit so um, if you're any shorter than me you won't have to really worry about the length but if you're any taller than me just keep in mind that they are 26 inch inseam and they will look a little bit short um, but Levi's usually makes different lengths in all of their jeans so I don't know why with the wedgie straight they don't do it but Levi's if you're listening to this video please make a longer length than the 26 inch inseam all right, so the next pair of denim I'm sharing with you guys is from Aritzia. It is from their in-house denim line, which is called Denim Forum. And if you are in the market for a new pair of denim, I really recommend that you check out Denim Forum at Aritzia because they have a lot of different styles and they are at a super affordable price point. Well, not super affordable, but more affordable than like $200. So they're between $98 and $110, which I think is great for the quality of jeans that you're getting. Um, so these ones are the Arlo Straight. Um, they are a light wash denim, I guess maybe a medium wash denim you would say this is, and I got these in a size 28. So what I would say about denim form at Aritzia is that they definitely run big. So when I was trying these pair on in the store, they were like skin tight and I was considering going up a size because they were like so uncomfortably tight, but they stretched out a ton and now they're a perfect fit, maybe even a little bit too loose. Um, so I would definitely recommend sizing down in these. Um, these have a button fly detail, just like the Levi's ones that I just showed, which I love because it's very vintage. And they also have a frayed hem at the bottom as well, just like the Levi's ones. So again, I recommend washing them and then hang drying them, not popping them in the dryer. As you can see, mine have already gotten <laughs> insane, but I've had these for like two years. Um, so I definitely recommend checking out Denim Forum if you are in the market for a new pair of jeans. And these are a straight leg style, which you guys will already have seen in the try-on portion. But I am like over the skinny look, over the super tight look. Um, it's just not comfortable. So I love how casual and relaxed straight leg jeans are. So that is definitely what I aim to go for. All right, so the next pair of denim is from the brand A Goldie, and A Goldie has amazing quality denim. I love A Goldie jeans, and they are kind of at a steeper price point, but it's definitely worth all the money. The quality is there, and they will last you forever. So the first pair that I'm sharing with you guys, these are called the Ren jeans, 
in the colorway blur i will have all the colorways and links down below for you guys just in case i don't say it but i got these in a size 27 and these are actually 100 percent cotton but a lot of the a goldie jeans are a softer cotton so they will stretch and mold to your body they're not like a stiff cotton like levi's so that's really nice so i got these in a size 27 so i actually sized down which i would recommend probably across the board from a goldie is to size down even if they're skin tight like put them on walk around the grocery store five days a week and stretch them out because they will stretch out and mold perfectly to your body so these ones are a wide leg style which is a little bit different than the straight like straight skinny straight slim that i've been showing you guys but you'll see how they fit in the try on i love the wide leg look i think that it's something different and especially for spring and summer it just looks really trendy and it's on trend with like the 70s that are always in especially in right now and these ones have a button fly detail which adds to the vintage quality as well I think pretty much all of my jeans have button detail, um, which I love a lot because it's just super vintage and makes your jeans look worn in and like you've had them forever. But these are the Ren, like I said, and I believe that these are at a $168 price point, so it's a little bit steep, but even if you can't you know, get multiple styles of A Goldie jeans because they are expensive, I do recommend that you think about investing in one pair. Okay, so the next pair of denim I have to share with you guys is from A. Goldie as well. Like I mentioned, I love A. Goldie, and these are the A. Goldie pinched waist jeans. So these ones are in a size 27. I ended up getting a size 27. Like I said, they run big, so size down. But these pinched waist jeans actually have stretch in them, which is amazing. They are super stretchy, which makes them super comfortable. And they are probably the most high waist pair of jeans that I have. Um, which is super flattering. So if you have like a bigger butt and a smaller waist definitely go for like a pair of super high waist jeans because it will accentuate your butt and make it look really good. You won't have that gapping in the back that I know that we all hate. <laughs> but these ones actually have a zipper which is something different. Um, and they have like a little flare which you guys will see in the triumph portion of this video. But I love these jeans. I think that the kick flare looks really good with like a super skinny boot in the fall it's just very on trend and I, I always get like a straight leg or like a straight jean but I thought that I would just try out the flare because since it's a kick flare it's not like two 1970s flare but I really love this pair of denim and they are so comfortable Okay, so for my last pair of denim, it is my tried and true pair of denim. If you have been keeping up with my videos here on YouTube, you will have seen these jeans in nearly every single one of those videos. But these are from A Goldie as well. These are the A Goldie 90s jean in the style snapshot. I got these in a size 27. Again, I sized down in A Goldie. And these ones really stretched out a lot to the point where they are now like boyfriend and casual and effortless, which I love so much. These ones have a button fly detail as well. They are super high waisted and I love the wash of these. I feel like the wash is really on trend with like the very light wash and I love that they have a little bit of distressing at the bottom. So they're not necessarily distressed in them, but they look worn in, which I love so much. And these are probably retailing for around $168, but if you get any jeans from this video, I definitely recommend you pick up the A Goldie 90s jean. You will not regret it. And they are a softer denim, like I mentioned before, so they do stretch out and they are so comfortable, which is important. Like, not only do you want your jeans to look good, but you want them to feel good as well. But a lot of the times I go for look and not comfort, but with these I get both, which is amazing. All right, you guys, that's it for today's video. Those are my top five denim picks that I love, the styles that I think look the most flattering on me and that have been around with me for the last couple of years. So thank you all so much for watching. Make sure that you leave me a like and a comment if you enjoyed this video because it helps me out so much. And make sure you subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And I will see you in my next video. Bye.